Just download Telugu Stop Android app in Play Store or iOS app in App Store and stay tuned to latest news as it happens. Kolkata, Kokrajhar, August 20th, the penultimate day of the group matches of the 132nd Durand Cup on Monday will feature the first and only game at the East Bengal grounds in Kolkata between the Kerala Blasters and the Indian Air Force football team, IAFFT. Followed by a crucial game in Kokrajhar Sai Stadium between the Indian Army football team, IAFT, and Rajasthan United FC, RUFC, the first Group C game in Kolkata has a scheduled kick-off at 3 p.m. Indian Standard Time, IST, while the second Group F game which kicks off at 6 p.m. IST in Kokrajhar, whatever be the result of the Kerala Blasters IAFFT game, both teams will be playing their final games of this edition of the Indian Oil Durand Cup. The Manjapadas have a solitary point from two games as do the airmen and a win and four points will certainly not be enough to qualify as one of the two second-placed sides. Besides champions Bengaluru FC can still log more points than both of them given they have a game in hand. Air Force coach Priya Darshan however was certain he wanted to sign off with a win, saying ahead of the game. Team needs a win and we will go all out for this. Frank Darwin, who has been deputizing for head coach Ivan Vukomanovic for the Durand Cup will also be hoping his talented side sign off with a win. They were on the wrong end of a seven-goal slug fest with Gokulam Kerala and drew with the champions. However someone like MD Aiming has really caught the eye and played some pleasing football for them. The final clash of Group F between the Indian Army football team and Rajasthan United FC will not only determine the fate of the two teams involved, but a few other teams in the tournament will also be looking at it with keen interest. The Army men have a 100% record so far from their two games and have looked a solid all-round unit. RUFC have mostly flattered to deceive but have still managed to keep themselves in contention. Given the scenario, the army can qualify even with a draw, but Rajasthan will need to win and win big to have hopes of making it through. The army's coach Ramesh Anthony said in a pre-match presser, Our preparations are good but it will be a tough match tomorrow as Rajasthan are a good team. The thing is even after winning two games we have not qualified as yet, so we have to go out tomorrow and win at any cost. Although we qualify even with a draw, but we will go out to win tomorrow. The same sentiment was echoed by Captain Christopher Cummy when he said, We are very motivated to win tomorrow's game and we will give a 100% as usual. We will not play for a draw, but play to win. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to channel and click on bell for more daily videos.